ahoy there, I'm up well. Welcome to my 100 miles in 5 days 20 miles on paper sounds easy, but after the second and third days, when the fatigue and aches start and then the blisters and the bleeding, by the last day it's very hard. I am doing this for my dad's charity, who died of cancer, so if you think me doing the 100 miles in 5 days is worth £5 the price of a cappuccino, please sponsor my charity page and I hash challenge other channels to get out and do something for their favourite charities. I will always support you. Hi, bonjour, everybody. Um, I'm having a nice walk again today. Um, I just uh, just drove the car and and the only, and I thought, I stop at this beautiful place and um, I'm in, I'm walking at point, I think I got it right, I don't know, point de, Tolo get, Tolo get. I think I pronounced it right because um, I might not pronounce it right, but that's it's point de, de Tolo get or something. Yeah. But um, yeah, I was, I was going, I was going to go somewhere else, but I just saw this beautiful view and I thought well, I'm going to stop here and uh, go for a nice little walk. So I'm going for a nice walk today, and it's so beautiful. The coast, look at it. It's um, very beautiful, and. Um, just want to say one thing though, I noticed about France, um, as I'm driving along, every, they've got loads of, you know, like in England, I thought England had a load of roundabouts, but in France they've got loads of roundabouts, but their roundabouts is absolutely beautiful. They, they, roundabouts, they do all these um, sculptures on there, plants and um, flowers and statues. They make shoes. They make it really pretty. Their roundabouts. So every little roundabout's got a theme, and it's so it's so beautiful. And um, another thing they got as well. You know, like the little zebra crossings. We get. Up. They've got loads of zebra crossings, so they think about the people uh, going past. Yeah, but this is absolutely beautiful. And look at this. That's why I stopped. I thought, wow, this is beautiful. So I am going. I am going to try to walk right over over to that point. So over there. So, but I'm just walking this way at the moment. So I'm just having a look around and look at the sea. Look how it, look how the sea is so calm. Wow, it is really calm. Look at it. I mean, just love to get my kayak, but. I think it's uh, it's drying it as well, and apparently it's gonna sort of like rain in a couple of days, so I don't want to sort of like uh, get it out again and then dry it, and then uh, yeah. But look, it's so calm. Look at the sea, it's beautiful. Right. I shall see you later. I'll take you on my walk. Sorry, I just saw a French van with a metal detector. Hello, a uh, metal detector. I wish. Exactly, he's got exactly the same one as I got, and I wish I took mine. Yeah, but there's an helicopter over there. Yeah. Well, I'm on my way over there to the point, it's called. So, there's a lovely look at these lovely uh, rocks over there. Look, so beautiful. And then, walking along. I just come across this um, as I'm walking and um, I don't know what this is, there's some sort of a, uh, I'll show you, some sort of a uh, Chinese theme here, just here, and there's an arrow pointing that way, so I presume if it's pointing that way, I presume it's probably going to these, uh, these stone stone things over there, these sculpture things. So, yeah. So standing here, yeah, maybe something to do with this. So something to do. It's got some Chinese writing and that. I don't know what that means. So I'm gonna sort of like take a look and see what it is. I'll see you later.
Right, I've come across um, this ruins and it's a, I think it used to be an old manor, a manor house or something. So a manor house in France, it's an old one, but yeah, I don't know, I'll have a look. I'll take, yeah, I'll have to be very careful because I don't think you're allowed in here, but, they, but it's all fenced off, but there's a bit of fence that's knocked down, so um, I'll just be very, very careful. Uh, yeah. So this must be an old manor house. It's so lovely. It must have been beautiful when it was, um, <clears throat> when it was uh, fully, you know, at the time. I don't know when it was first built. Yeah. So you can just see, and that must, probably must have been a, a spiral staircase going up. And yeah. Uh, have a look, I'll take you round. That must have been a pillar, the old pillars. Very pretty. Yeah. Now there's wild birds living there. No. <laughs> yeah, so it's like a manor house or something. Uh, but I'm just going to, um, when I get home, I'm just going to uh, sort of look up on, look up about this, uh, just to see if they had any old pictures. Oh, I think somebody's reading something there, so this must be an old picture that it used to be like. I'll wait till they go and have a look. <coughs> but yeah, it's, uh, oh, that must be like Romeo and Juliet's balcony. <laughs> Wow, just going through it. It must be like a, I think that could be like a little fireplace thing, uh, something. Yeah, they've got the windows. So I'll have a look, they're gone now. So I'm gonna just see if I have got a picture of this when it was uh, when it was in its former glory. So I don't know, so I'll have a look. coming across it now ah oh, this one it used to be like oh my god it's so beautiful um saint paul Roux leaves paris in 1898 having come to hate it for his being ostracized and for the mediocrity of the literary criticism circles ignoring it with as much pride as he himself had been ignored on a clairvoyance advice and also to escape his creditors he left Firstly for the Ardennes, living off the revenue he earned from his libretto for the opera Louise, he bought a house overlooking the ocean he transformed it into a manor in the Baroque style. He named it the Manoir de Coisai. I haven't got my glasses, but yeah, St. Paul Rook or something, yeah. 18, hang on, 1861 to 1940. So that's when it started, but yeah, this is the picture, the actual picture of the manor house. And this must be the person that used to live there. But I'm sort of like, it's all in French, so I'm not very good at French, but if anybody can read French, they can sort of like, yeah, wow. And that's what the house is. So you've got that bit there. Um, this bit is that over there and you've got the four the four four towers and then you've got that bit over there with those towers and then you've got the the balcony the balcony up there which there there's the balcony so, wow yeah that's really good it must have been a pretty pretty place at the time so i shall see you later bye Hi, I've been to the done the chateau place, the manor house, and I am going right up the top of here and trying to get to the edge over there, and then coming back on myself over that way. So it is a lovely day, and um, yeah, it's very very beautiful. And keep saying that, don't I? <laughs> um, yeah, so it's a nice 
nice little walk up to the top just to see to see if I get some nice views over that way as well so that's why I'm going up there I shall see you later and I show you this look at that it reminds me of I don't know whether you know but it reminds me of like a Robertson Crusoe you know like the, the beach of Robertson Crusoe where you land shipwreck just reminds me of that very pretty Hi, I got to the top and I found this lovely wall along here and plus beautiful views and you can't beat that, look at that beautiful views and uh, look at all around it is so beautiful like, wow <laughs> are these weird birds making some weird noise but yeah, lots two coppers over there, two policemen, I don't know what they're there for, oops, maybe, I don't know, maybe the one arrests me, <laughs> I'm just gonna go here, and it's worth coming up here, I don't know what's, oh something's over there, as you can see, that right over there, so I'm gonna go to, try to go over there, and have a look, so I should take you in a minute. See you later. Um, a military defence mission, like Mission Impossible. And I met these two policemen, but they was, I said, I take a photo, they were said yes, but, and then I said, oh, it's for YouTube, and they went, no, 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 no. So they didn't want me to do a YouTube, which is understandable. I respect their wishes. But this is uh, all about it here. Uh, I hang on. So I, oh god, I haven't got my glasses. Well, it's probably in French, but um, I haven't a clue what it says. So if anybody learnt a good French at school, you know they can read that. So I thought I learned. So uh, I'm just. Uh, in, but this is so beautiful. Why not to let me see? I said I didn't want to film my hope they don't arrest me but oh yeah I can walk along here oh wow a car coming <laughs> probably bang me up in a French prison or something be like that what's it called Les Miserables or something or, I don't know <laughs> probably have to cut my hair and sell it which I had my hair cut anyway I had it uh, chopped off, trimmed, tidied up a bit because I had the Covid hair before and uh, it grew like a like a wild it just grew, you know when hair grows when you're like a Covid and it just, just I got rid of the straggly ends so as you can see that all the straggly ends are off now so it's all nice and tidy but, yeah. that's the wall a bit good for zombies you know, not letting any any zombie people in. Uh, <clears throat> that is actually see? lovely. I know I keep saying that, or oh, what's that thing? And I always say, oh, well, this thing here and that thing, because my brain goes, and my brain, I don't know. As you get an up, as you get to an age, your brain goes. Well, my brain's gone anyway, but I, I'm not. <laughs> I can think of things, but I can't think it out. Does that sound? <laughs> I can't, um, I can sort of like, I know it, but I can't just, I can't remember it or something. So, yeah, I shall see you later. Right, I am 
going to go for going to go for lunch now, and I'm, I'm going to go now. So, so everyone, uh, au revoir, and, and everybody stay safe. I can't. I don't know how to say safe in French, but I know to say au revoir. But look at this. This is a lovely view, and I am going to oh, look at that. Just show you this view. Wow. Look at that. Look at that blue. I can't. It's blooming October. October. And yeah. And I, I'm just going to walk all the way over that way somewhere. Over there. It's where I parked my car somewhere. So I can hope I can remember. But I know it's heading, heading towards the circle. Heading towards that way and over that way. So I'm going to go to this path here and go around then go over to there and I shall see you on another day on another adventure bye <laughs>